Hey guys, welcome to or welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we will be reviewing the new BSM 12 subwoofer from Hyanka. So this sub is going to be a two ohm sub and it's going to be their the lowest power series they actually have. I think it's about $60 on Amazon. Pop it up on the screen for you. And yeah, let's get into this. So let's look at the side right here. So the magnet, we have a Y30 grade double stack uh, magnet. Impedance 2 to 4 ohms. It is a 2 inch voice coil. I think it's just this copper coil. Um, let's see, frequency 35 to 1000 hertz, which is insane. I think it's just going to be, it's just going to be the low notes. So 35 to like maybe 60 or 80. Uh, X max eight millimeters X max. So it's not the biggest sub ever. I mean, it is 250 Watts RMS. So it's going to be their smallest line so far. And let's get into it. Let's get in out of the box. All right, guys. So we have the manual right here and it also comes with this. I think this is like to put in between your box and the subwoofer. So it has a little bit of foam to mount on. I'm like, I never use that anyway. Uh, here's the manual and let's go through the manual a little bit. As always, guys, I will leave links in the description for this sub and the other one I reviewed. And also, go check out my affiliate links. Um, I'm affiliated with Redodo Power, uh, Power Queen, Big Jeff Audio, and Serwin Vega. Go check out in the description if you want to purchase any of those. Use my code in the description for a given person off your order. All right, let's get into this one. All right, guys, so if you haven't seen my other video on uh, the BSC uh 12 go check that out it was a really good video um 500 watts rms was that sub it went through that wattage very well five uh five minutes through that watt rms rating and today we're go i always go by the four ohm version i don't really do the two ohm version uh because i believe that it should just be one rms rating and i'm just gonna go with the lowest so the bsm is rated at 250 watts RMS max power 500 8 millimeters X max and the other one the BSC is actually 12 millimeters max max so you get a little bit more um, and I'm pretty sure they're about the same price on Amazon I could pop up the other one right here and I'll let you know if you want to just spend the extra like 10 bucks to get the freaking uh, BSC because right now I think that the BSC is one of my favorite subs from Hyanka and it hits the lows pretty well for what it is. And yeah, let's get into this thing. Let's get it out of the box. All right, guys. So we're using the Hyanka, the new Hyanka dust cap that's on that one and this one. And just a little comparison between the two. Let me bring this one over there. So that's a little comparison. I really, really love the BSC. Um, it was great. I really love the rips around, how well it, it performed at its RMS rating. And it has a two and a half inch coil. This one has a two inch coil. And honestly, they both have stitched around, which is nice to see. Paper cone. And this one, this paper cone is a little bit different than this one. Same dust cap. Same dust cap. A little bit different surround. Kind of reminds me of this surround on one of the Serwin Vegas. Kind of the same material. So I really, I actually like that surround. Flip it over, we have a pretty small magnet. Um, this is gonna be the two ohm version. And here's something I really do like seeing guys. On subs that are very low in RMS rating, normally it's gonna be a single voice coil, but this one is gonna be a dual voice coil. So you could hook it down to either, you can hook it down to one ohm, or if you have two of these, you can even hook it down to half an ohm. Um, also, something I do really like is that Hyanka, um, Hyanka has their thing right there and it's screwed down. All right, um, let's see. The tinsel lead is going to be sewn into the spider, which is nice to see. The spider looks kind of cheaply made. It is a China brand sub. Let's look at this coil. I don't know if you can see the coil, but that, that is a two inch copper coil. The venting is pretty good. Um, it is just clear glue. It's clear glue coil. So we're just gonna see how well it can actually handle this, how we handle its RMS power. I really don't think it can do much more than 250 watts RMS. Just looking at it, 
But hey, we'll see. I'll let you know. We'll do a brutal RMS test. We'll do a music test. But first, we got to break this sub in. So let's do that. Breaking it in real quick. We're sitting at, we're doing a little sweep from 20 to 50 hertz. A little less than half power just to get this spider moving. Another thing I like is this uh, this exhaust, I'd say, I guess, is venting back here, which is really nice. Deathbox doesn't even have that. So that's good to see from Hyanka. All right, let's get it in the box. All right, guys, got the sub broken in. As you can see, broken in. So we're going to hook it up to the box and give you all a little demo, music demo and RMS test. All right, let's get it. All right, guys, we got the High Inca hooked up to the car, and right now we're going to do a music test. So we're going to play Please Don't Go by uh, Night Lavelle. I got pain, but I'm Guys, I mean, that was a little music test. Uh, as you can see, we were peaking up to about uh, five to 700 watts. Now, when it hit that 700 watts, I did have to turn it down a little bit because it did start stinking a little bit because it is only a 250 watt RMS sub. So next thing we're gonna do actually is gonna be an excursion test. I really wanna see how this thing handles those low excursions. Um, I'm gonna go until it bottoms out and then and then uh, turn it down one volume so you can see the excursion. All right, let's get it. All right, let's get let's turn it up a little bit. Pushing through 150 watts, 2.6 ohms. Yeah, let's get into the RMS test. Hey guys, unfortunately I have to cut this video short <gasps> because I'm going to have to have a separate video of the RMS test because shit got real, man. Shit got real. Stay tuned for the next episode, our next, uh, next uh, video, and see what happened to my setup in my in this sub and yeah i'll see y'all in the next one peace thank y'all for watching and like comment subscribe and help me out because that's all i gotta say all right guys peace